Alright guys, welcome back to Into the Bleach. Uh, so we got ourselves a Zenith Guard now. Uh, so we have to kill an enemy by pulling it into yourself. Hit four enemies with a single laser and block, a sh uh, block damage with a shield four times in a single battle. Uh, that seems hard. But we have uh, the Science Vessel, I guess. That's what it looks like to me. You can pull a target or you can shield two tiles. You, you shield the tiles from damage, but do the enemy do the uh, do the mechs keep it when you shield them as well? So and he's got a charge attack too, which may have been really good to keep the other guy. But I mean, I had no idea I'd get this guy. I mean, I can still get take change him to the other time traveler. He just won't have any levels. But if the game is yeah here he is. But if the game is hard enough, then maybe I'll do that. I don't know. And then laser three damage, nice. So that's kind of nice. Um, so let's get this started. I'm interested to see how this one lines up. Uh, we'll start on the this island just to mix things up. Uh, also, let's have a look at these. So, you can make allies immune. Friendliness will not take damage from the attack, which might be good for uh, buildings, because I think it's going to also apply to buildings, because it looks like it doesn't end. Grid defense, mech move. And we already know how ramming engines work. Apparently attraction pulse isn't getting anything, but apparently you can get another use out of uh, shield projector. So that's that's okay. Thing is, he's very much a kind of a support thing. I don't think I want to start with that since I haven't played with this guy before. We'll try this one first. Uh, Alright, what's a good position for these guys? Alright. Vec are going to be sorry now. All right. Well, this is an issue. What's this giving? They heal one at the start of a return. Uh huh. Well, we have a laser, and it doesn't look like we're going to be able to block anything. I mean, this guy does things. But yeah. Just trying to debate how to do this. So you can pull things into you to kill them. Let's do something like pull this guy into us. Railgun this guy. And bash this asshole. But he takes damage every time, which is unfortunate. All right. Well, we can pull that guy towards us, or we can... Well, we can't really kill that guy, so... Uh, and they're not even lined up at all. And I, and this guy, every time he does anything, he takes damage. So, that's a problem. Can I shield projector myself? I cannot. That's an interesting note. I can't even move up here to take out this guy at all. So, we have a couple options. I can go over here. Yeah, but I, I don't think I'm going to be able to do... It, it's, it's two damage on the second tile. So, okay, I think I have an idea of how to handle this. Okay, let's do this. Oh, no, we can't do that. Let's go this and then shield the two buildings. Wow, this, this actually sucks. I actually hate this thing. Actually, you can't do that. Because now I can't really hit this guy. Oh, how much damage does he do? One. Alright, that's fine. We'll just take the one damage. I, I fucked that up actually majorly because of the shields. Forgot about the order in which I have to do things. Alright. This may be a problem. Alright, so this should be pretty easy to handle. I'll go here and just laser these guys. A lot of damage though. Problem, the problem is with this guy, because he needs to repair every once in a while. But we can do this kind of stuff. That guy needs so much repairs, though. We're going to have to work on giving him something else to do. Alright. Last player turn. 
I feel sorry for the poor sap that actually has to deal with that. All right, how do we save this guy at all? <laughs> I don't know if we can. We, okay, so, huh. Pro the problem is this, this vehicle is so useless. I would like to, I can't really do much with that actually at all, honestly. All right, if we push him onto that tile, it would be good, but we can't. So we have this guy with the railgun, but they've created this line where I can't get, a, a, I can't line up anything. I, I've apparently used both of my shields and one of them was a complete waste. Um, what order is this going in? They do one damage each. So I, I can save this guy from death in several ways, but I can't. I don't think I can do anything with this guy because I can't. I, I I can't move this this thing anywhere because I could save him because I can bash something away. Uh, I just wish I could get over there somehow. But yeah, we can do that. I, I'm actually really sad here. I'm incredibly sad. I couldn't even make it down to these, these two tiles, so this thing's gonna get hit. Whatever, fuck you. Current three. Uh, you know what I should do actually? It just occurred to me something. So I'm supposed to finish it with less than a couple of damage. So I don't know if there's a better way of doing this, but I should spend my turn repairing this. And there's like nothing you can do with this like at all. So uh, we're just gonna have to accept this the way it is because we can't move. And something's gonna take damage, so. I gotta be careful with that shield. I should probably just waste, like, not waste, but like save that until the end. It's kind of a sad story, but yeah. Well, we get our we get our thing back at least. Alright, I guess we are good enough to do these now. Defend both power plants and the battle with less than four mech damage. Why is that the thing it wants to do all the time? I don't want to end the battle with less damage. Oh goody, a pod. Alright, Lily's useless, I regret that instantly. Alright. Uh, so here's the thing, I can hit both of these, but that guy is going to be in the way. And honestly, I can't really deal anything. Oh my god, three damage. That's ridiculous. Huh. How much health does he have? So I'm just curious, does the repulsor? No, it's blocked by things. All right. And this guy doesn't, well, Lily is in this thing. The, the, the one movement mech I have, Lily is in. So it's good times. All right, I have, I have some ideas of how to handle this. Alright, first off, let me decide where this guy's gonna go. Alright, I, I know how we're gonna handle this. Alright, we're gonna bash this guy out of the way. Come over here. Uh, bring this guy over here. And then we can pretty much just kill someone. Uh, we can just do a laser straight down here. Not the most ideal situation, but it's still pretty good. All I know is I seriously need some upgrades and some other things. Alright. Well, unfortunately, this is what's ha occurred right now. Well, let's see. Alright, I'm thinking we we defend these two buildings, although I don't think I can because I think it has a minimum range. Yeah. Wow. That's tough. So how do I get as many in the line as I can? 
That's, uh, I may have just fucked myself, but I, I don't know, man. What was the solution? Who knows? And, like, I can't get into a good position to pull someone back either, so. Uh. Start my life. Okay, so. You know what? We can maybe just ignore these two guys. Like, I can just maybe heal myself and then live through whatever they have to, to get to deal with me. Um. We can use this guy to... Like, I wish I could shield both of these, but I really can't. Because it's like... Yeah. If I only had a little bit more movement. I regret not having Lily on the f this fucking... Oh no, that's only on first movement. But that's still... She still has one plus one movement. That would have actually done it. That's ridiculous. Because I can only do this. Which is uh, less than ideal. Because there's a, there's a thing in the way there. Alright, all right, I have an idea. We block the way with one of them. But I won't be able to kill them. I think we're gonna accept that we're gonna take some damage here. Like this. But it should deal with most of it. I think we cannot just do anything here, so we're gonna have to repair him. They're in a nice line now. Alright, so if we shoot these guys, these will all die. But we can also use the Repulsor. Or we can heal them. There's actually a fair bit of options here. Um, it would be nice to put some of this stuff in the way here. Okay, I think I, I, think I have most of how I'm going to do this. Uh, alright. So I think we're gonna laser these two. Cause that, that solves two problems right there. Which that's, that's worth. Um, I can either move this guy into the way, block it and repair in his turn. Or something else. Um. Cause I can, I can, I can block that one as well. This guy does not have a lot of HP by the way. Which is, it, it's highly, inf it's really odd, this playstyle, because of the fact that um, two of my mechs, I can't use for damage most of the time. Like, this guy, I can't use him for damage because he's constantly wounded. And Genos can't really do much either. So we're going to have to do something like this. I kind of didn't want to do, but it's so weird. This the, 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 These loadouts of mechs is kind of strange. As I said, if I had the other guy, it would have actually worked really well, because he would have actually been perfectly fine the entire time. Alright. Yeah, we can pretty much just win this right off the bat. So we just kind of shoot this guy. Alright. I mean, the easiest thing to do would be to just repair right here. Uh, and we can... Actually, yeah, undo move. Here, we can go right to here. Efficiency. I won't, I won't deny this is actually... These guys are kind of difficult in the fact that it's just we lack damage, I would say. Let me see if I got any reactors at all. Cause that's that would really come handy right about now. No, I don't have any bonus reactors, but I am gonna I think I'm gonna move Oh, maybe we got one now. Mech can move through enemy units. Okay, so for a guy that's good at positioning, this might be the one. Maneuverable. That's all he has? Okay. And I think for this science mech, we're gonna have the movement on her. I mean, I, I thought it would be a good idea in this guy, but I, I don't think at any time I've ever had like a like an opportunity to basically just position myself right off the bat. And honestly, to make this guy much more useful, we're gonna give him the health upgrade. Cause that's like way too needed for that guy. Oh, we gotta good we gotta defend the train now. 
Um, I've only done this kind of uh, scenario for defending the train like like once or twice, but it's actually kind of interesting. So the train kind of just moves every turn in the middle. I'm not sure how it treats certain things, but yeah. All right, so so this guy would be good to. What does he do? Uh, heals one at the beginning of every turn. All right. So, the easiest thing to do would be to actually pull him back. We can pull him back and then we can push this guy onto over here. But, I mean, it's not really going to do anything. Push him back. You can be pulled over this way so the train can go through. And then uh, we will laser this guy. The train just kind of moves, and it has like one HP, so we have to, we do have to prevent it from dying. And there you go, it moves. Uh, now I'm not too sure if it runs over things or if I don't think it counts as like a hazard. Okay, so it says here it's going to run into my own train, so the train is going to die. That's what that's what it's saying it's going to do. All right. Uh, what's the order of the turns? Okay, he goes first. I would really like him to be able to go there, but... Alright, so I guess we're gonna just bash this guy. Laser these guys. Now we can either shield this, or we can pull him, uh, which is a much better use of our turn. All right. Uh, let's see here. So we have this guy causing me a problem here. Can I even do any damage to him at all? No, I really can't. Actually, what happens if I go like here and then... No, it's gonna hurt, hurt him again. So... It's a difficult question of how to deal with a lot of these guys. Because I have I have a lot of kiting capacity here. So let us utilize our kiting capacity. And there we go. Okay, that was a lifesaver, having that guy have more HP. Because I was able to basically just use him every single turn. And this guy got more mech move. Which one do I have him in? This one? Okay, that's good. That's the, honestly probably one of the best abilities you can get on these guys. Kill four enemies inflicted with acid or destroy acid bats. Oh, we can do this one. This one's nice. Alright, so... We'll do something like that. All right. Ah. Uh, easiest thing would be to move him back and then move this guy down. Uh, but let's move nobody around. Just trying to think of what to do about this guy. So I was gonna move this guy onto this platform, block it, and then pull this guy back. But it may not be a possibility. Because of the way this guy is positioned. But we can, like I said, we can just heal. Heal that thing, so. Because we need to kind of. Uh, we can bash this guy out, actually. I'm actually up for that. So, what I was going to do, actually. I was going to go here and I was going to project. Use the, this thing right here. And then we can move over here. Yeah, it, it stays on me too. It's nice. And we can flick this guy with acid on him. There you go. Shield worked. And we even take damage for that, which is nice. Alright. Let's have a look here. Uh, let's see. 
I'm supposed to kill a bunch of enemies uh, that kind of have the acid debuff on them. Um, these guys do one damage each, so it's really not a big deal. So they're both kind of hit, trying to hit over here. So what I could do is I could go over here, pull him over, have this guy block, and then this guy can, I don't know, railgun this guy? I don't know. Because I think he's going to do four damage, yeah. So that's not a bad option here. Because you kind of hurt them both. Everybody takes a bit of damage. Uh, well, I didn't actually just expect that guy to die right off the bat, honestly. Um, uh, this guy didn't get a turn yet. So who do we kill? I guess this guy. Uh, who do we who do we prefer to get hit? The probably probably my base mech. Even though he's gonna have one HP by the end of this. The ramming guy is very useful. Alright. Yeah, we gotta watch out for this. Alright, so here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna move him over here. Let's go over here, pull him towards us. Uh, reset our turn, because I completely forgot about the fact he was going to shoot during his turn. So we can't actually do that, but this guy does need to move. Can I get through... No, I can't go through obstacles. Alright. Hit him with a little, that bullshit. That's the problem with this guy. I can't really do anything better here. I can laser this. I was thinking of maybe just like having it... Okay, I have an idea. Wait, I already used this guy's turn. Who did I, whose turn did I not use? Lily's and this thing. I was thinking of shielding, but I'm not sure now. This guy fire yet? No, he didn't. Okay, here, let's try something like this. How long does it last for? Okay, I think it lasts until it's actually used. Let's try this out. Uh, we didn't get there to use your turn. Okay, well, he didn't get to use his turn, but I think this is worth, and I can, actually, I can repair him for his turn. Good thing I have that thing on, the, 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 the little thing telling me this stuff. All right. It's a couple of actions here we gotta take. Alright, so we're trying to kill four enemies with acid. I mean, we gotta do that all in one turn, so. So, I'm trying to think here. I can maybe kill this guy. Alright, is that how I'm gonna do it? Fuck, it hits the building. Forgot about that. She gets most of them, but we, we need to still kill something with acid on it. We need that sweet, sweet bonus fucking bullshit, because we get two of them, too. So... We kill one, but we have to kill this one, then. So who, whose turns do I have left? I, I'm, I'm honestly kind of just feeling like, you know... Just kind of manning up and going and doing it. Actually, can I even kill him? I can. Yeah, fuck it. You know what? I don't care. It's more important. We got priorities, guys. And the priorities are: we need, we need things. We need, we need uh, whatever those things are called, because it's worth. We need reputation. Alright. Well, uh, we don't have anything else to do with our grid HQ, so, well. Destroy Firefly Leader and Protect Corporate Tower. Alright, so he's right here. Launch two goo projectiles, so we've, we've dealt with him before. Luckily, we do have a lot of options for moving him around, so that's kind of nice. Alright. 
Alright. I mean, we can just kind of laser him right now, but... I think we're gonna need to pull him back, though. Just trying to think here. Because he's gonna hit two buildings here, and for a great deal of damage. Like, he gets what he wants, and it's it's fucking four, uh, three grid damage right like that. So, and we can't sustain a direct hit from this guy at all, so... These are the two issues that we've come up with. So I think we need to... I think the only uh, solution here is we need to pull him back. Back over here, because this way he can't get hit by anybody. Alright, so there's that. Now here's a question. Can we kind of do a lot of damage to this guy? We kind of can. And we can actually finish him off with this mech, because the thing is, I can't really shoot him here anyways. So... Maybe that's what we'll do. Actually, how much damage does this guy do? Two damage. Well... Wow. Really wasn't gonna end any other way. Alright. Best we could do. Can't really block anything. All right. So, uh, identical problem. Uh, this one's actually worse because I can't actually. If I pull him here, then this guy's gonna die. Well, actually, maybe. Yeah, he's gonna die if I do that. I'm trying to think because I pro problem is I actually we could go over here. The problem is this guy has no mobility whatsoever. Because I'm not allowed to walk around that building. You know what? I have a bit of an idea. Acid is how much damage again? I think it's a lot of damage. So... We're gonna do something a little bit ballsy, but we can't because this guy can't move. How much damage would you do? Okay. I resisted. Good, 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 good. Yeah, he's in the acid now, but... Worth. <laughs> uh, yeah, we just kind of melted him, so that's why I didn't stun. I mean, from that entire engagement, we lost one thing. The railgun to end all railguns. Alright, well, this guy's gonna take a bit of damage, but it's okay. Good time it is, guys. It's achievement time. Yeah, I love achievements. Fuck, that doesn't work. I keep forgetting about the lasers. I need to get that thing where like he doesn't take damage from his own shit. That that's like the worst. All right, we did it. That was fun. Did not lose anything. Good stuff. Perfect island. Nice. Would not have assumed I would do it with these guys. Oh, we get to choose something. Uh, yeah, how about we choose the guy that's armored? Oh, fuck that. That's a good idea. <laughs> that, th how lucky is that? How lucky is that? Alright. Mike Luck, everyone, I know. The, the guy I was exactly saying, you know, holy shit, alright, fires an acid pro uh, projectile and pushes. That might, that might be pretty good. What's this one? Drops five smoke bombs on the map, okay. Okay, no self-destruct, so. So we can donate these two mechs, potentially. Because we have really good pilots right now, weirdly enough. 
I didn't know you got rewards for perfect island. I guess that's like nothing took no no, things did take damage. How is it perfect then? I guess I I guess I got every single reward. Have I never done that up to now? Huh. Alright, so blocking mechs might not be so bad. Especially with this guy. Ours and projectile and put and pushes. That seems better than my other thing. I won't lie. Because at least I'm applying acid. There's like, I either can do a push or a pull, you know? And so which, which one would I prefer? Probably the acid that pushes. It's a, it's a close contender, but yeah. Uh, so that's pretty good. All right. Uh, so let's see here. I really need movement on all these guys. I'm probably making allies immune to this. So that's what we're gonna do. So I'm gonna get two reactor slots sell this thing and we're gonna get uh, one point at least I'm gonna just test it here oh it does hit it oh okay so it just makes my friends immune it's still not a bad thing though it's a really nice meme though starts from four it still can be really good but oh man the combo with the acid though is insane. That's some decent comboing, actually. Alright, let's get some movement on some of these guys. Here's the question, do I want- if I sell these two guys, I can get one more reactor point. Yeah, fuck these guys. I think- I think- I think I made up my mind. So who do I want to get? I guess this guy. Movement is so nice. All right, we did well. All right, well, that's all the time we get for today, guys. Uh, next time, I'll do the other islands. Uh, take care.